For years, we've had to deal with Hollywood's woke onslaught of destructive agendas in their films. That changes today. That's why we launched Epicverse. At Epicverse, we care about excellent storytelling and respect for our fans. Things Hollywood has forgotten. So follow Epicverse wherever you can and tell your friends. We can't win without you. <laughs> Jokeify and destroy everything. Jokeify. Burn, baby! Burn! Wow, dude, it's a pretty good... Did you say it? From the ashes of Hollywood. The comeback starts today. Will you join us? Will you join them, Max? Will you join them? <laughs> Fucking right in the puppy! Welcome to the Epic Verse Podcast, where curiosities and theories run wild about the strange and spectacular and everything in between. Let's suppose that you were able every night to dream any dream you wanted to dream. And that you could, for example, have the power within one night to dream 75 years of time. My friends, this woke Hollywood actor who makes millions and millions of dollars in Hollywood is in deep emotional distress. Bro, in this absolutely wild video that we're going to be checking out here today, Mark Ruffalo just got interrupted, completely humiliated, called out, exposed, all of that stuff. COVID-19 vaccines can cause heart attacks, blood clots, exactly. myocarditis. I hear you, man, and I feel that. <laughs> what? <laughs> Did he not just hear what that guy said? <laughs> He's like, I hear you, man. Like, you can tell. You can tell that Mark Ruffalo is completely just flummoxed by this entire thing that's happening during his extremely precious moment where he gets his Hollywood Walk of Fame star, guys. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I, uh... <laughs> A few moments <laughs> later. Absolutely hilarious and completely ridiculous. Whippets. <laughs> Wanna break from the end? Absolutely hilarious and completely ridiculous. <laughs> What if I told you imaginary friends are real? Hi. 
Stand back. I'm gonna kick my butt. My ass. Hey, Patrick, this is Steve Carell. Your dad uh, let us know that you had been in the hospital and that you're doing better, which is great. And Nancy and I wish you a very speedy recovery. Steve Carell, The Office, I don't know. That's, that's pretty much it. Obama is a war criminal! Look up! Sometimes I get so mad! I'm going to destroy your chair! I know your dream. I want you to be happy. Your dream has always been to dance through the audience. It I heard been, the yes. way I dance with the audience. What the man? It's about to touch the table. The <laughs> 2 opens in theaters July. You know what? I don't have to answer to you. You ain't my bitch. Kill yourself! Bitches running wild, man. Kill yourself. I absolve you of your sins. How was the party? I wasn't invited. <laughs> Actually, no, that's not the truth, Ellen. You were invited. Last year, no, last time I was on the show, last year, you gave me a bunch of about not inviting you, but I didn't even know you wanted to be invited. Well, who doesn't want to be invited to a party? I can see the future. A beautiful drone shot. The kind of video that you might see in a travel video, right? Except it's not real. There is no drone. There is no camera. You can't travel because the video was generated by AI. It's from a new tool just announced a few hours ago by OpenAI called Sora. All it takes is typing in a short text, a prompt, and in minutes it spits out a 60 second video clip of pretty much anything you can imagine. Pretty much anything you can imagine. Oh yeah, I'll show you AI.